In PowerPoint 2013, it's quite easy to insert online video. You just have to have it set up. Let's jump into PowerPoint and take a look at the setup first of all. It's in the backstage. So when I go into my backstage, of course you click File to get there. Go down to your accounts. And under Accounts, any connected service that has videos available, you can use to insert online videos. Let me scroll all the way to the bottom here. At Add a Service, here's how these were added in. Under Images and Videos, originally when nothing has been added in, this list will say Flickr, Facebook, and um, YouTube. And so what I have done is I've added in the service of Facebook and I've added in the service of YouTube. So those two are added in and should be available for me to insert video. Okay, so now you know how to make sure you've added in the service. Now where do you insert the video? Makes sense. You go to the Insert tab and look for Video. It's all the way at the end in the Media Group. There you go. Video is right there. Drop it down. And Online Video. And it says, Find and insert videos from a variety of online sources. It's not any and every online source, but it's a variety of online sources. So you go ahead and click on Online Video. And whatever you're connected to is going to show up here. So you saw my connection to Facebook, and I also am logged in right now to my Demo Tutorial Outlook account, so that OneDrive is available. What about YouTube? Where did YouTube go? Well, I did some research, and I'm reading a statement directly off of Microsoft's website. Due to changes in the YouTube service, PowerPoint 2013 is currently unable to support YouTube videos. Microsoft is currently investigating potential fixes to this feature. So currently, YouTube is not available. When it becomes available again, it will show up here and you'll be able to click on it just like I'm about to do with Facebook. It was here, I promise. I've used the feature in PowerPoint 2013 in the past. So what happens if you have a video that was inserted using this insert video back in the day when YouTube was an option here? The statement says, due to changes in the YouTube service, PowerPoint is currently unable to support YouTube videos. It says support. It doesn't say insert. It says support. So I'm guessing that videos that you've inserted in the past using YouTube may not work. So check out any presentation that might have some of those YouTube videos in them. Well, here's how you insert though. Whether you use the OneDrive or Facebook, you simply click on the service. So I click on my Facebook service. I don't have very many videos. This is my personal Facebook account. And I don't have very many videos, but I do have this fun video of these iguanas. And of course, you'd be inserting a video because it's supporting your presentation in some way. You wouldn't be putting it in just because it's a fun, cute video, unless it supports your presentation. You can only connect or excuse me uh, download one video at a time so even though in some situations you can hold shift or control and select more than one one video at a time so you simply click on the video you want to download it'll tell you that you have the item selected and then you simply click on insert and it will download that video and it becomes part of your slide so now here is the the video of the iguanas they're kind of interesting creatures and usually they're very very calm and subdued but this particular day at this restaurant these iguanas were having quite the fun time let me just play it for you oh, I can take off the sound here there we go so the iguanas are having a, a um, something, some kind of a time here. But they're very, very fun. And like I said, they're normally very docile animals. So the day I saw this, I thought it was interesting how to videotape it. This is at a little restaurant down in uh, the Virgin Islands in St. Thomas. And they, they feed these critters, so they show up every day. <laughs> People like to watch them. So the video is just going to play until it gets to the end of the video. And as soon as it gets to the end of the video, then it stops the video simply stops. Now this is on this slide. I'm just working in my presentation. What happens when you're showing the presentation? Well then you just go out to the slideshow and you'll see a clip. Uh, it'll just stop in time. You'll have one clip of the video and then to play it you rest your mouse on it and you simply click with the hand to start playing it. Now on this one I didn't turn off the sound so this one's going to have the sound. You see then you can play it as part of your presentation. Whatever it is you want to do with your presentation you've got it. So let me go ahead and hit escape because escape will take me out of the video. It stops the video and then it will take me out of the slide. So now as you can see, it's really easy. Be sure you go backstage and set up your account. Make sure that you've connected, you add the service so that you can use the feature for Facebook. Right now, sorry, you can't use the YouTube feature. And if you're connected to your OneDrive, you'll automatically be able to insert videos using your OneDrive. So those are two great features that you have now using PowerPoint 2013 and inserting videos from a variety of online sources. We hope you enjoyed this preview video. Please click on the like button below if you did and subscribe to our YouTube channel.
Be sure to visit us at www.kalliance.com to sign up for your free seven-day trial today. You could learn a lot in a week.